so first i'll start with the application so first is deep learning so deep learning is a branch of machine learning that teaches computers to do what comes naturally to humans right so just like we humans learn from experiences so with deep learning we can do tasks like image recognition facial recognition motion detections okay so like this way we can do work in deep learning okay for that deep learning toolbox is there we can also work in autonomous driving environment with this deep learning toolbox so next internet of things so we can use matlab for internet of things so in this thing in this thing so things speaks is uses right so basically things speaks is a cloud based service and it works as a data aggregator or you can say a uh, analytics okay for more detail you can just go to the thingspeaks.com so that you know you you will get more information there so what is things speak work so it is free for student so you can you know you can use this thingspeak.com to his project so autonomous system okay so convert your ideas and concepts into autonomous system so that works seamlessly in real world environment so for autonomous system we have some toolboxes so you can work seamlessly uh, in your project right automotive so if you, if you talk about the automotive so we can design and simulate electric vehicle or hybrid electric vehicle or other concepts vehicle into matlab using matlab and simulation along with this okay for for different conditions for robotics so uh, it is also useful for robotics also so okay you can design your concept in simulation environment so you can build algorithm for robotics also if i talk about like if you want to just use matlab with simulation so that is possible you, you will have to int integrate the matlab with simulation so that is possible now if you talk about the electromechanical thing so we can take leverage mathworks tools as a development and test environment for large multi physics machineries okay using some multi domain simulation so if i if i want to design some supervisory uh, uh, supervisory system so i'll just uh, give the logic for mul multiple systems right such as wind turbine and so on so things are that we can do in simulink environment so uh, if you talk about the aeronautics so we can also design some some broad application in matlab and simulink like aeronautics okay so as you can see in this short video or we can say the this is the gif so how it is landing right so so these are uh, many applications you can use you can use matlab and simulink platform so can depend upon your requirement and you can design this 3d scene into matlab and simulink 